Hello, my friends. This is Jeannie. Welcome. I want to share with you an entry that I received for my I Made It Challenge. This entry is from one of my international friends here on YouTube, Liz Linda Hansen, who is from Germany. Now, I know Linda because she won one of my previous challenges and if i recall correctly she won the set of spectrum noir markers if i remember i'm pretty sure that's what it was so i was super excited to receive an entry from her and it is an amazing amazing entry let me first share with you the card that she made how sweet is this card i love the ephemera on the card and the use of the lace is, it's just, it's lovely, beautiful. I'm going to be adding that to one of my junk journals for sure. One of my memory junk journals. This is a super cute tag that she made. This is too cute. This is so adorable. I love the colors. That little girl is sweet. Inspire, dream, imagine. Beautiful tag. She sent some butterfly embellishments. Aren't they gorgeous? Beautiful. I love the rhinestone. And this paper is kind of like a pearlescent paper. Very pretty. Very pretty. And the packaging is gorgeous. Beautiful. She sent this tag. And it has... Um, let's see if I can open this. Bum, 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 bum. Am I the only one that when I open things, like I admire them and then I immediately put them back in the package, like to protect them? <laughs> Silly, I know, right? Isn't this beautiful? Look at this tag. And it has a charm dangling on the end of it. Gorgeous. It has this fan. It says here, believe. Beautiful. How fun would this be to hang in my planner? One of my smaller planners. Not my big one that lays on my desk and is constantly being molested by my cats, but one of my smaller ones that I carry with me. I think I'm going to try to do that with this tag. Now, let me put it back where it belongs, safely tucked away. <laughs> there's the tag she altered this cute look at how cute this cute little book it's like a little journal book and she altered the front with some lace these are like um velvet hearts here she has some lace she altered the back as well if you open the inside, look how sweet that is. Love that. Really sweet. I will be using this book for sure. Look at that. Cute book. And then she sent me this awesome canvas. I'm telling you, my room is going to look like, like a museum a tribute to beautiful mixed media type canvases because look at this this is the second uh i'm calling the mixed media canvas that i have received so far in this um challenge <laughs> oh my gosh um and let's see i've received i think the first one i received was from nola harris and now i have this one from linda hansen isn't it beautiful? Gorgeous. And look at the dimension on this. Can you see that? And she altered this from top to bottom, side to side. It's beautiful. Has this beautiful little ribbon on it that I can hang. And look at this fairy. It looks like a, some kind of wood embellishment that she colored up. Beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. Actually, now that I'm looking at this, I might have to rethink putting this in my room. I think I'm going to put this in my daughter's room. Yeah, 
this definitely goes with the decor or the colors in her room her room she has pinks blues um and uh lighter not quite pastel but not deep rich colors either the girl picked her own palette and on that day she was cray cray so she has colors everywhere <laughs> and this reminds me right here of the colors in her room so i think this is going to go in her room that's where i'm gonna put it so those are her entries my friends but i have to share with you she sent me some paper and oh my god i'm super excited about this paper now linda has sent me paper in the past she has some of the most beautiful gorgeous papers um and she's so generous in sharing them with me and this oh my gosh guys this tops it off look at this it's the wizard of oz i had no idea this paper even existed Look at this, flying monkeys. Here we have the witch, ruby red sandals. This is when the house fell on her. Naughty, naughty, naughty. Yellow brick road, Emerald City. We have the little gang here on the yellow brick, brick road. There's the scarecrow. This paper is gorgeous. The hot air balloon. Look at uh, Gwenda, Glenda. <laughs> Gwenda. I combined a couple of names there. Oh my goodness. Some awesome cut aparts. I mean, the paper she finds is just beautiful. Yellow brick road. Absolutely gorgeous. So thank you so, so much, Linda. I truly do appreciate you taking the time to participate in my challenge. And I wish you the best of luck, my friends. Until next time. Bye-bye.